Hey guys, I'm Anna, and today I'm going to show you how to fix PowerSchool app if it isn't letting you log into your PowerSchool account. It might be possible that you're not able to log into the PowerSchool app due to a connectivity issue. So first of all, you need to make sure you have a strong and stable internet connection. To do so, you need to do a quick test to check if your internet's working or not. Simply open up an app that runs on internet other than the PowerSchool app and check if it's working or not. You can also try switching from Wi-Fi to mobile data and vice versa. Doing this might help you log into your PowerSchool mobile app. This should fix the issue, but if it doesn't, then you need to make sure you're running the latest version of the app. Open up App Store on your device, and then tap on this search icon in the bottom right corner. Then search for the PowerSchool app. And if you see this update button right next to the app name, simply tap on it to make sure you're running the latest version of the app. But if you still encounter this issue, then you need to clear App Cache. Go to your device settings and then scroll all the way down to General and tap on it. Then tap on iPhone Storage. From here, search for the PowerSchool app and then tap on it. Once you're on this screen, you need to tap on Offload app. Tap again to confirm. It'll take a bit for processing and then a reinstall button will show up. Simply tap on it to reinstall the app. This should fix the issue, but if it doesn't, then you need to completely reinstall the app. Follow the on-screen instructions to navigate all the way to the app page. Once you're on this screen, tap on Delete App to uninstall the app from your device. Once uninstalled, you need to open up App Store and then search for the PowerSchool app right over here in the search bar. And then click on this Get button to install it back on your device. Well, that's how you fix PowerSchool app if it isn't letting you log into your PowerSchool account. I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up to see more videos like this, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you in the next one.